I knew CDS was the right place for us when going on the school tour with Sarah DeWitt. She took us into the pre-K classroom where the teachers created this beautiful environment of love, laughter, curiosity, simplicity, and the whole environment was just magical to me. And from that moment, I knew this is where we wanted to be. My favorite memory is um, being rewarded for our hard work. So one of the rewards we would get with Miss Glick was going on ice cream walks to Baskin Robbins. So being at CDS, it taught me that not only does hard work pay off in delicious treats and grades, but to work hard, play hard, and be kind. The teachers lead by example. They are upstanders. They really live the values, the midot that the students are learning about. The kids are coming home like, my four-year-old is coming home talking about kindness and about filling the bucket and his teachers are just such incredible humans. I am inspired by CDS teachers literally each and every day. When I've been in meetings all day and have been talking to adults all day, I know I can walk into any classroom at CDS and get that moment of joy, the, the feeling that kids are engaged and learning and enjoying it and being very thoughtful about what's going on. Our teachers are really high in emotional intelligence and they really know these kids well and they have a great rapport. And that just takes a lot of emotional energy to invest in the kids like that. And so it makes me really proud because they take that time and they do that work um, and they build those relationships. And then the evidence of that is, is that our graduates, when they come back, they just want to hang out with their former teachers. Our CDS teachers are so special because they create an environment where students are allowed to be their authentic selves and there is an environment where they are valued and allowed to be goofy and experiment and take risks. I love that our teachers are wanting to be continual learners, that they want to grow themselves as educators and provide the best possible instruction for our students, and that's what makes me the most proud. Why do I teach? Um, I teach because I really believe I can make a difference. I teach for a lot of reasons. Um, first and foremost, it's for the children, obviously. They are what makes being here worth it. Um, in every way, shape, and form. Now, other reasons I teach is not just to make sure that they're aware of their academics and learning and growing in those ways, but to really just make sure that we're teaching them how to be human beings, how to exist in a society and in a community with one another, how to love themselves and each other, really how to be alive. And so it's really important to me that our academics reflect that type of learning. I teach because I want kids to be heard and to feel like their voice matters. I choose to teach at CDS because I feel both the freedom and the support to continually challenge myself as an educator every day and surrounded by the most dedicated staff and curious young learners, um, I feel motivated to do just that every day. So I think in the short time that I've been here, I think it's really become clear that the education they get here turns the kids into menches. We see it with the community building, we see it with the tribes, the Shvatim, um, and the infusing of Jewish values into every level of teaching, whether it's general studies or whether it's Judaic studies. And um, I think that when they come out of CDS, they're menches, and, and that's really adheres to the Jewish value of love your neighbor as yourself, the golden rule, if you want to say that, and I think that's what impresses me about the school. I feel like the impact that the education from CDS has been on my family has been amazing. My kids come home from school and they are so excited to tell us what they learned. And in particular, the Hebrew portion, it's something that we can't give them at home. And they come home and they teach us. And it's just been really exciting to watch my two kids bond over the blessings that they learn at school, talk about Kabbalat Shabbats, and um, just seeing how over even the dinner table, them singing in the middle of dinner, everything that they've learned. And it's just made us really proud to be here.